Hello, 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 everybody. It's me. It's I Hate Will. And today, I'm going to be showing you how to record your PC footage using your Elgato Game Capture HD device. This particular tutorial is for a one screen setup. I will be using my wife's laptop, but this technique works for desktops as well. Here are the items that you will need an Elgato Game Capture device, of course, an HDMI cable. Elgato provides one. A mini USB to full USB cable. Again, Elgato came with one. And a computer. Optional devices are a pair of headphones with separate volume control. This is a cheap set that I got off Amazon for my wife. And a microphone. First, take your Elgato game capture device and insert your HDMI cable into the HDMI in slot. Make sure that you are not using the HDMI out slot. It's clearly labeled. Then, plug the other end of that HDMI cable into your computer's HDMI slot. Next, take the mini USB cable and plug that into your Elgato. There's only one slot that it'll fit into, so you're not going to mess it up. Plug the other end of that mini USB cable into an available USB slot in your computer. Once everything is connected, go ahead and start up the Elgato Capture software because we are ready to record. So here we are. We're now recording what's on our computer's display. Now we're ready to record video on our favorite games. However, we're not quite ready to record the audio along with it. Here's how you're going to do that. If you're using a Windows computer, move your mouse pointer to the speaker icon on your toolbar. Right click and select playback devices. Make sure that your output speakers are set as the default device. Next, go to the recording tab. If you do not have a listening for stereo mix, right click and turn on the show disabled devices option. Right click on the stereo mix icon and enter properties. Place a check mark in the Listen to This Device box. Then go to the Levels button and ensure that your volume level is set to 100%. Hit OK. And then run a test to see if the audio is working fine. Stephanie and I always do this when we record. All you have to do is open any file or visit any web page that makes noise and make sure that you're recording at the same time. <laughs> jump, 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 jump. Jump, do it. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna count the. No, no, I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> Close the recording and then open the file to see if the sound was in fact recorded. If the answer is yes, then you are good to go. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> you are now prepared to not only record video, but to also record your game audio and Skype conversations for when you multiplayer. Well, I hope you learned something. I have more tutorials coming very soon, but for now, I am signing off. This is Will, take care of yourself, and I'll see you next time.